What's going on guys, it's your boy Ooze back in once again and here with a reaction for My Hero 1's Justice 2 official gameplay trailer. Now I'm actually surprised that we actually have a trailer, but it is Comic Con season and from word on the street is that there actually might be a demo at Comic Con right now. Don't quote me on that. Um, because the person that actually told me, they said that they weren't actually sure if the kiosks that they had available at Comic Con were in fact for my hero wants justice 2 because that is what we're going to be reacting to right now so it's a minute 33 seconds long um what i'm hoping to see out of this is honestly any kind of inclination as to the changes that we need to happen if this game is to be playable um it's to have any high replay value and it's to have any kind of improvements on the last um but I'm sure we're probably going to see a lot of cinematics, a lot of flashiness, probably some supers, and most likely characters that weren't even in the last game. Um, I'm hoping to see some, maybe a little peek at some returning features like the uh, um, the character customization uh, with the costumes, which is one of the things that definitely was a lot of fun to mess around with in the last game. So let's uh, hope for the best and let's get... <laughs> Here goes nothing. Okay. Oh wow, the big three is going to be playable. That's cool. So far, the same. Looks like we're going to have some uh, interactive stage stuff going on. More, yep, more of the classroom folks. Big three. Hmm. Well, Dobby's still playable. That's nice. <laughs> uh, yep, overhaul. He was in the uh, Oshigaraki new outfit. Okay, to match uh, what he looks like now. Okay, guys, so, um, yeah, as I feared, it looks the same. No difference. It's copy paste so far. Um, I noticed maybe like four or five new characters. Gameplay mechanics look just about the same with how the combo system works. You got bounce, you got OTGs with off the ground bounces. Um, I didn't really notice any wall splats, but for the sake of the trailer, I'm pretty sure, um, I'm just trying to peep. Okay, so right here, we see that there's going to be a stage interaction, which is something that other fighting games um, have been doing. So we've definitely seen this in other games, but this is going to be the first time that we're going to be seeing it in this game. There was no stage interaction outside of ring outs from the last one. So, I mean, that's cool, I guess, right? Check it out. Right through the freaking floor. He's one of the new characters right there. Lamillion. I forget the other two names, so excuse me for not remembering the big three. There's a lot of characters to remember, man. A lot of them. Alright, so yeah, so she's also new. I forget her name, but she's also a part of the class. Um, oh, so she looks like she's going to have long range, which is nice. Long range characters um, typically will have some kind of advantage in this game. Um, characters that have long range projectiles, projectiles to keep you away, tend to have an easier time with dealing with a lot of the bull... That this game has to offer. Um, yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying to spot out any last second um, 
how do you call it? Any like last second things with the combos as far as like getting splats. This is the one thing that they haven't shown. Um, there's no splat combos. There's nothing that no nothing that splats. They've just been doing pretty basic uh, combos. Nothing too fancy for the trailer. I mean, I guess it is pretty early on, but not for anything. If the game's supposed to come out in 2020, right? If it's supposed to come out, well, we see the we see like the EX versions of the moves where they get the the bounce up. And they can continue to follow up afterwards because they're still in the air. So you can follow up with like the super dash. I forget what the dash mechanic is called, but you you zoom in, um, you like homing on them, and you can continue uh, messing them up from there. But yeah, I mean, just just to just okay, just to get just to put into perspective for you guys. Okay, the game is so copy and paste still. And the game is supposed to come out in 2020. We don't know exactly when. I wouldn't be surprised if it was early 2020. I wouldn't be surprised if it was like January or February or as late as March. Okay, there's no reason for this game to come out in the spring, especially when they're trying to take advantage of how season four literally starts in like a week, give or take, from the time of this recording, right? Season four, um, I don't recall how many episodes it's gonna have. I'm, pr I'm going to take a guess and say 24, which would probably last it through the remainder of this year and, in, and bleed into next year. Um, and I would imagine they would want this game to release while the anime is still going on. Just look at how many characters they've already shown off that are playable. A lot of the base roster from last game, including like four or five new characters. You have the big three um you have uh the new the chick from the classroom the pink girl with the long with the long range projectiles i'm sorry i'm forgetting her name her um the acid chick right and then of course you have overhaul like they got fi they're showing five new playable characters so far while the rest of them are all returning characters oh wait a minute make that six i just realized that they put my man, um, Mineta. I'm pretty sure Mineta is playable now. Pretty sure they teased it a little bit. I forget where exactly this is in the trailer. But I'm pretty positive I saw Mineta as a playable character. I'm gonna just, just... I'm gonna... Oh, yeah, look. He's right here. After this combo. He's playable. Okay, so six. They showed six new characters with the rest of them being... Returning, and you don't think this is copy paste, and they're gonna show all this in the one official tr gameplay trailer already. The game's supposed to come out next year. Hold that. All right, guys. Well, that's the that's the that's the reaction and breakdown. I guess I wasn't really thinking of breaking it down, but like I just I don't know if I'm I don't know if it's me just trying to prove a point. But again, I am. I am I am just as much interested as the next person in seeing how this game turns out. Because if it is true that yes, um, I also forgot to mention that this game is bait is being made apparently off of fan a fan survey. So if the fan survey is supposed to be anything of value, then we're this is supposed to be better than the last one, because they're gonna take the suggestions off the survey. And apply those changes to this game. I don't know. We'll see what happens, guys. Keep it locked and loaded. Classy right here on Uchi Games channel. Like, share, subscribe. Hit me up on Twitter. All that good stuff. Socials are going to be in the description. Yes, we're back on Facebook now. Which is nice. Um, there's a post as to why I was off Facebook. But it's explained on the Facebook page. So please go ahead and check that out. Like the page for me if you can. Um, yeah. Have yourselves a good one. May the power protect you. I'll see you guys next time.